Hi, it's Dr. Clark. I want to talk to you today about some of the latest research concerning these guys. You ever heard of them? NSAIDs or non-steroidal anti-inflammatories, something that's used by the billions of prescriptions and users every year. Three billion non-prescription uses of NSAIDs every year in America, not to mention 30 plus million prescription for NSAIDs. So here's the problem. You've heard about all the um, uh, addictions and about all the overdoses and the deaths that are associated with uh, opioids and the opioid crisis that we're in right now. I'm gonna talk more to uh, about that in a second. But what I wanna talk about today is in general ADRs. That is adverse drug reactions. There are over 2 million adverse drug reactions in America every year that are reported and known of. Now, this is also the third leading cause of death in America. And I'm gonna say this, NSAIDs alone is the 15th leading cause of death. That's aspirin, Advil, ibuprofen, these type of drugs are, are more deaths in America every year than is caused from AIDS. And nobody's talking about these guys and they're passed out like candy and like there's no side effects to this. But what this research that you're gonna see that we post this week, it talks about is how there, these drug reactions are more common than you think and the ones to NSAIDs are even almost as dangerous as the opioids. Now, I will say that 59% of all opioids that are used are used for back pain. That's shocking, isn't it? So how do people get addicted and how they have over uh, doses? Most of the time it starts with having back pain. So now what they're saying in this research is that we could decrease the use of opioids, we could decrease the deaths and the addictions by 50 plus percent just by getting people to see chiropractors first. Wouldn't that be an amazing thing if we would just uh, think about correcting the underlying problem instead of just reaching for a pill of some sort to cover up the symptoms? By doing that, we got a whole lot less side effects, we got a whole lot less addiction, and a lot less drug use overall. So pass this information on to your friends. These guys might not be as safe as you think. Be sure and view the research that we're going to publish. And you can look it up also on pubmed.gov as well. So God bless. Until next time, live life well.